Bashisha Sven was born in the temple town Bishnapur in 1887. He was an agricultural scientist whom Professor Swami Nathan, the man of green revolution, accepted as his predecessor. Bashi was a spiritualist, a great admirer and follower of Swami Vivekananda. Bashi's father Rameshwar was an inspector of schools and helped to set up schools in rural areas of Bengal. Bashi was a leading plant physiologist in the then India, a man of extraordinary talent, a lovable personality in the eyes of eminent persons of our country and the world. Unfortunately, he is forgotten in his native place. Institutions where he received academic education in a school of Rachi, in St. Javier's College, Calcutta University. Sister Nivedita introduced him to Sir Jagadish Chandra Bose. Boshi was under his tutelage 12 years. Laboratories where he did his research work. Laboratory set up by Sir Jesse Bose in Presidency College. But he was there from 1911 to 1916. Bose Institute set up by Sir Jesse Bose. But he was there from 1917 to 1923. Kitchen Laboratory set up by Bose himself in the name of Swami Vivekananda in 1924, in Bosparalen, Vivekanand Laboratory in Almora, set by himself in 1926. Strange Wise Laboratory, Cambridge, London, Marine Biological Laboratory, Plymouth, Laboratory of New York University. Boshi was a spiritual thinker, spiritual guidance blessings and grace from Swami Sadanand, the first monk disciple of Swami Vivekanand, Sister Nivedita, Swami Brahmanand, Swami Saradanand, Sister Kristin, above all from Sri Srima Sarada Devi. Sri Srima visited Bose's ancestral house in Vishnupur several times stayed there a few days every year. Swami Sadanan spent a few weeks in Bose's ancestral house. Personalities with whom Bose had acquaintance and familiarity. Rabindranath Tagore, Pandit Jawaharlal Nehru, Albert Einstein, H.G. Wells, Roma Roland, Parlesh Bach, Somerset Mom, Carl Jung, Dilip Kumar Roy, D. H. Lawrence, Julian Huxley, Mrs. Indira Gandhi, and many others. Boshi was awarded Patma Bhushan in 1957. His wife Gertrude received Padma Sri in 1976. Service offered to the ailing superiors. But he served the ailing monk Swami Shadanan, his spiritual guide, in Bospara Lane, Calcutta, when he was the student of St. Javier's College. He looked after ailing sister Christine and got her admitted in the city nursing home, New York, after her expiry. He had her cremated. What a son does generally for his mother. Boshi and Gertrude got married in 1932. Gertrude Emerson was an adventurer, an explorer, and a writer. Her book, The Voiceless India, was published in 1930. 
Rabindranath Tagore wrote the introduction to the British edition of the book. Gertrude was the Indian correspondent of the journal Asia. The conjugal life of Boshi and Gertrude lasted for more than 38 years. Boshi passed away on the 31st August 1971 in the military hospital Rani Khet. His last words, Mother, I am coming. Boshi and Gertrude had no issue. So far my knowledge is concerned. No step has yet been taken to construct a memorial in his birthplace. Since 1922, Mr. Uday Mandal of Sankartala and his friends have been trying to make the local people aware of the greatness and importance of this patriot scientist. Mr. Hari Prasanna Mishra, a local educationist, has been trying his best. Hoshla, a sincere and a popular organization, is ever ready to support any step in the right direction to commemorate Vashishashen. We request every citizen to come forward and work for this noble cause. Om Purnamada Purnamidang Purnata Purnamudachyate Purnasha Purnamadaya Purnameva Vashishyate Om Shanti 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 If you want to know about Vashishya Shain and Gertrude Emerson Sen vividly, you have to read three books. Two in English, Nearer Heaven Than Earth by Girish Mehra, Almora's Couple Extraordinary by Binayak Lohani, Mehra's book contains 800 pages. Ebong Ekti Bangla Poi, Vivekananda Prashishya, Vigani Boshishya Shen, Rachoita Sri Nitaenag, Jada Bangla Poi Poren, Tara, a boy to put a shamrit the hobbin.